so updates from my uh, Volvo XC90 uh, I just got from the junkyard and uh, what I got seats black seats black seats and everything on this car um, I just don't like the uh, the uh, cream or light uh, brown seats on my car um, they get to like uh, get dirty and look worn actually um, even though I clean this one with uh, uh, paint and uh, clear coat it looks decent but uh, yeah um, I prefer to replace it with, uh, with that one with a black leather it just needs cleaning and it has also a monitor but I don't know if it's working um, it has like some uh, the, the, the car that I have uh, the car that I took it from actually has some factory connections somewhere in the in the console in the center console but I don't know where the main DVD is so uh, I said forget it uh, nobody is actually using that one so I'm gonna replace the uh, this one too um, I got all of that right back so if you look at my handle my handle is like okay, worn out but uh, it's still okay though so I also have to replace this one you know this uh, this latch over here Yep, it's a problem. And the problem with this is that um, I need to put it back like that. Uh, there's a rubber in there that uh, springs it back, but it's not doing that anymore because the rubber is busted. Yeah, it works, but... You have, to, you have to push it back yeah, because it stays there so you have to manually push it back so yep I got a I got all the four door cards all the uh, seats except for the uh, the third row um, I don't think there's a need to open up the third row um, I don't use it all the time so I just leave it the original and then uh, I also have this uh, piece. Um, mine is broken in that area. If you look at this, yeah, it's missing. So I'd rather like replace that thing. So it needs cleanup. And then I tried the blower motor too. This is from the 2007 S60, and it's tough to pick up, and especially if you can move the seats. So the total for everything is 124 plus 28, so it's like 220, and that includes and that includes some uh, minor stuff. Um, I also got the. Uh, a broken corner grill on the bumper and uh, the leak detection pump yeah I'm going to replace the leak detection pump because I'm getting a check engine code for the leak detection pump it's a P2040 yep. okay so yep well I'm gonna make a video again to uh, on how to replace the uh, the seats.